Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It is time I finally review the La Mer, the new Next Gen Treatment Lotion. You guys, I'm just gonna get, let's just get right into this. You know, there's an opening, please subscribe to my channel, do whatever you gotta do, but like right now the real tea is this product, period, done, let's get into it. <sighs> La Mer lovers of the world. La Mer fanciers, La Mer devotees, just La Mer fanatics like me. Rejoice! We have the next gen. I feel like if you're a La Mer addict like myself, like the treatment lotion is like, like just so, it's like the all-star of the La Mer brand. Like, yeah, you get, how do you not love the treatment lotion by La Mer? Like, it is just like so cushiony and like good and just like soothing and like, just so amazing going on to your skin. Like, how would you not love this product, right? Like, I just, when I apply this product to my skin, I'm just like, ah. like the one day I was looking at my husband and I was just like, how do you not love this? Like, how? Like, I feel like you're missing out on life if you don't apply this to your face. Like, it's that good. That's just how I genuinely feel. Like, I that I just love it. I've already used this much of it. It's new. If you're if you're new to this product, first of all, what what is this? This is almost like an essence. It's supposed to prep your skin. It's supposed to energize and hydrate your skin before your routine. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna, you know, cleanse your face first, then you're gonna go in with your toner, then you're gonna apply this, then you're gonna go in with your concentrates, then you're gonna go in with your serums, then you're gonna go in with your moisturizer. But this is your first real step in prepping your La Mer routine gonna give your skin a burst of hydration and it's really gonna like wake your skin up and give it a good plump surge of hydration and there's really not much not to like there's really not I don't know in my opinion there's nothing to not like about this product now the first gen okay so La Mer did a facelift period they upgraded the consistency of this product they upgraded the ingredients they upgraded the packaging and uh we got to talk about it because this was what if you guys don't know this was one of the first products i ever reviewed on my channel but like let's take it back a couple years and let's just bring you to the first gen yes you guys i've been saving the first generation of the treatment lotion just for this video and she's old and busted and i even have a little bit left just for this video i have an old sample i'm gonna try to go back and forth with i'm gonna open it because i want to try to compare it's gonna be hard comparing this because it's probably expired let's go over like the obvious differences first the packaging was a huge upgrade for this product the old packaging you can see it's plastic which kind of goes against like the environment and really what La Mer is all about with like the ocean and the environment and keeping the ocean water safe they really should be like get, getting away from their plastic packaging that's just my opinion because it's so like outdated and La Mer is so luxe like to begin with like guys this has to go and they're on their way. So they went from plastic to glass and this packaging gets an A++. It's heavy, it's nice, it's oh, like it's just so divine. Like here, here's a closer look, right? So much nicer and better. The green is deeper. It's that La Mer gorgeous green. They still kept like this chrome going around. I absolutely love the upgrade that they did because guys this stuff is expensive and it should look expensive not only does it feel expensive and it is expensive but it's got to look expensive on your countertop and this definitely was starting to get outdated so that's to start and it's definitely um heavy and even when you look through the glass you could see like the like the bubbles and you could actually see the formula in this packaging even better Better. and I just think there's something so like scientific about it I don't know like it looks like it's a concoction straight out of a lab and I'm kind of obsessing about it and I've been obsessing about it and I love looking at this just it's just so juicy and good okay so the big difference that I've noticed is obviously the hydrogel. It's thicker in consistency than the last one. This is supposed to apply 
almost like a serum this time. It's not as watery. They actually call this, do they call this the watery lotion? I remember when like I first saw this, that I was like, what are these watery lotions? Like, what is that? I think I even said that in my first video. 3.4 ounces is 125 and then the five ounce, which is this, is 180. Guys, it's worth every cent period it's really good i don't even think 180 dollars is a lot for how good this product is like seriously there are some cleansers out there that are pushing 180 like not even kidding so i think that's a bargain that's the truth i'm gonna put the new treatment lotion on my face and apply it for you i'm just not gonna put this one on my face because girl <laughs> she's old but let's just show you guys texture so here it is See if I can get you guys like a really good like dropping moment. Yes, you guys see how thick that is this time? It's not as watery as it used to be. So you can kind of see it. Do you see how it kind of just drips like that? You could see how it's thicker. And then when it comes down, it's still watery, but you could see that it's not that watery. It's still just a little thicker in consistency and it's giving you a hydrogel Finish. I'm going to read a little bit about this product with you, but I really wanted to show you how it comes out because it's really about the different formula in this new generation. So I just like to put a little bit on my hands and what the product and how much you get with just a little drops, it covers my whole face and neck beautifully. I love just, there is just taking this all down just take it as far as it can go if i could like soak my entire body in this stuff like every day of my life i would be so happy and i would be like so young looking like this stuff is incredible like beyond if you are dry skin like this is going to be your best friend honestly any skin type this product is going to be your best friend this is just one of those no-brainer products by la mer where it's like don't think about it you just gotta buy it because it's that good it still has that classic la mer smell that we love and cherish but the details of the product are we got some on the bottle oh no never never waste la mer that is a rule on this channel that is the biggest rule on this channel. We douse ourselves in La Mer. We freaking bathe in La Mer. Are you kidding me? La Mer is our Bible. Like, oh God, we live for La Mer. Okay. We live for La Mer. All right. So the details, not that we need them, but we'll read them. The next generation watery lotion powered by cell recharging miracle broth, which we love the miracle broth. If I can ingest the miracle broth, I would, uh, delivers a rush of liquid. You actually could eat the miracle broth in La Mer's beginning days, just FYI, fun fact. Um, delivers a rush of liquid energy to jumpstart your regime, of course. Your essential first step after cleansing, it's active liquid hydrogel texture, which is the biggest difference I've noticed between the old and the new, by the way. Cushions on contact and penetrates rapidly to deliver energy and sustained all day hydration to optimize skin for the full benefits of every treatment that follows, which is giving us what? essence vibes but it's giving more of an essence this does so much more than just kind of like open your pores and helps um oncoming products seep in it does more than an essence in my opinion it gives gives you better hydration it preps your skin it plumps your skin it gives nourishment to your skin like i think it does so much more than just an essence so to call this an essence is just wouldn't do it justice so i totally agree with lamer by calling it a lotion a watery lotion but honestly this is giving me more of like oh god I, I almost say you could almost use this as a moisturizer at this point but don't you know that's totally up to you in a clinical study, 100% of panelists had an immediate surge of healing hydration. Yeah, duh. Um, the ingredients, Miracle Broth, the Revival Ferment. The Revival Ferment. Yes, please. And then, of course, the Active Liquid Hydrogel. 
How to use. After cleansing, sprinkle a small amount onto fingertips or saturate a cotton pad. Guys, I never use a cotton pad with this. I actually don't recommend using a cotton pad with this. Don't waste a single drop. The cotton pad's just gonna absorb the product. I don't recommend that. I don't think that this does, a, don't, I don't use this as a toner either. This is not a toner. Put it on your fingertips, get every last drop onto your skin, period, nothing else to say there. Press into skin, follow with your La Mer Serum, eye treatment, and moisturizer. Yeah, then your skin's gonna look freaking incredible. Alrighty, so let's just open up the old, because I'm, I'm just, I'm curious to see what, okay, well the old isn't, that much, oh. So the old is giving almost the same consistency, to be honest with you. Did you guys see how that was kind of thick coming out? Let's try that again. So here's the old consistency, although I will say it's probably expired. So did you see how that kind of came out in a gel-like consistency? So that's old. Don't want to waste any more of the new, but here's new. I'm just going to put a little drop. Okay. So I'm looking at them now. Well, the old is definitely waterier, so I'm going to have them drip down. This is old. This is new. If you can make that out. I don't know. I'm gonna to try to get some sun flicker in it and you guys tell me if you notice anything different. I do wanna let you guys know, La Mer does have a three year shelf life though. So, old, new. Don't be too discouraged because it can't be that outdated. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I'm not seeing that big of a difference. Okay, well. This is the new and it comes right down my arm, no problem. Just the longevity of the product, this is the new. I'm bringing it all down my arm. I'm able to take the new stuff with like a drop or two and take it all the way down here. Just FYI, the old, I can do the same. So what is so different about these two? Because if it comes to physically feeling a difference, you know, they're both banging products and Physically, I mean, they're both pretty much right there. I know the noob, aside from the facelift and the packaging, is supposed to give you more of a serum type experience. And I know it's supposed to have more of the miracle broth and it's supposed to have an advanced ferment to help protect the skin and encouraging it to resist visible irritation and sensitivity for a calm, healthy looking complexion. So that's the revival ferment. And that the active liquid gel crafted from a ferment anti-irritant, this propriety texture cushions on contact and penetrates rapidly to deliver sustained all day hydration. So I think what they did here is they increased the miracle broth updated their ferments, did, uh, they tweaked the ingredients a little bit just to make it better, and of course, upgraded the packaging. Do I think, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, do I think this is like so much more, do I think it's so different from the old? No. Do I think it's better than the old? Yes. Do I think it's crazy better? No, do I think it's worse than the old? Absolutely not. Do I think they improved on the quality? Yes, I do. You guys, that is it for this video. I'm very happy with the upgrade. They tweaked it just enough to make it even better than it was before. I think they needed to be super delicate with this upgrade because you don't wanna fix what isn't broken. This was not broken. It was great as it was. And I think with situations like that, you have to be, like in my opinion, you have to be delicate with what you're doing because you don't 
as I said, you don't want to fix what isn't broken. And I think they did a fantastic job with just upgrading what was already so great. Everybody, thanks for watching. If you're new here, definitely subscribe for more of these honest, enthusiastic reviews. I love you guys. If you haven't done so already, subscribe. I love you guys. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Love you. Bye.